The Little Fox and the Sea The little fox had heard the wise eagle who traveled the world say that the sunrise by the sea was breathtaking. He really wanted to go and see it with a friend, but he couldn't decide who to go with. The little fox realized that being a bad person made him lonely because he didn't have any friends. So, he decided to change and become a good child. With a bouquet of flowers in his hands, the little fox went to the bird's house. Birdie, I'm sorry. I used to steal your things. Now, will you be my friend? I've changed. The bird, seeing it was the fox, got frightened and hid in the closet. I'm scared. Go away quickly, or I'll call the police. Just believe me. I've really changed. The bird suddenly ran out of the house and yelled at the fox, you liar. Get out of here. The little fox felt dejected and continued down the path until he reached the door of the squirrel's house. He called out, squirrel, will you be my friend? I won't bully you anymore, I promise. The squirrel heard the fox's voice and yelled, don't come in. You're a bad fox. I won't trust you again. After that, the squirrel locked all the boxes in the house. The little fox was extremely disappointed. As he was about to return home, he saw a little rooster walking towards him. He said to the rooster, Rooster, be my friend. The rooster, as soon as he saw the fox, screamed in fear, Go away, or I'll hit you. The rooster picked up a stick lying nearby. The little fox suddenly burst into tears. None of you believe me, and none of you want to be my friend. War. The rooster took a closer look and saw the fox's sincere expression, unlike a pretense. So, he said, do you really want to be my friend? Yes, I really want a friend to go with me to see the sea. Great, let's go see the sea. That's amazing. The rooster and the little fox set off on their journey. When they were tired, they rested on the grass. When they were thirsty, they drank from a mountain stream. When it rained, they found a cave to hide in. When the rooster was hungry, the little fox caught grasshoppers for him. And when the rooster was tired, the little fox carried him. They were not afraid of hardship, crossed mountains and hills, and finally arrived at the seashore. The sea was truly beautiful. Flocks of seagulls flew freely in the sky. In the crystal blue sea water, fish played and swam towards them. They sat by the sea, watching the sunrise and sunset. They talked, laughed, sang and danced together, having a wonderful time. The little fox thought, being a good child is wonderful. Having a friend is wonderful.